can you shed light on like various rounds of interviews in google like in detail like what are the different rounds and uh, what are the particular agenda in each uh, interview round so every candidate's interview experience will be a little different because i mean it depends on what Google wants at that time and what kind of policies they're practicing because these things keep getting up there. So I don't want to say something that <laughs> somebody comes and they're like, oh, he said that thing and something else happened. Uh, so I'll just focus on the broader aspect. Um, generally speaking, they do a mix of uh, online assessment, phone assessment, and on site interviews or virtual on site interviews, uh, like any other tech company. Um, you're expected to have, you know, a level of understanding about coding. Um, you'll be expected to write code, uh, of course, uh, as for any software engineering job. Uh, there'll be evaluations on, you know, whether you're a fit for the culture or not, uh, you know, different kind of aspects. And, you know, a number of people will come together and make a call on the final decision on whether a candidate is a fit for Google or not. And from there, there are some internal processes which I cannot talk about uh here uh, which go forward and you know uh, at the end the candidate finds out the results whether they are hired or not and that's pretty much it that's like a broad aspect and it, it's it varies like for example um some candidates may experience that they might have something say like a system design interview and some might not for senior more senior levels i think in the tech industry it's not expected that you code as much but it's expected that you would have a, a bigger scope, if you will, as compared to a fresh college grad. You would be able to see different moving parts in a system. So that kind of stuff. Yeah, got it. And like, uh, I have also heard, like you can tell uh, from your experience, like there are like multiple rounds, like uh, usually like, and it all depends upon like different companies. Like previously, I remember like there used to be like uh, two or three rounds. And then like eventually like, all the companies started having like four or five rounds, like once one or two round on like phone call and they're like a bit casual, just get to know you, you are interested on the, in the position, then like a uh, coding interview challenge, uh, you submit an assessment, then like discussion on that particular thing. Then like sometimes like uh, the solution architect aspect, like do you, how much do you know about that? So uh, what's your experience in that case? So if I remember correctly, I had about seven rounds. Um, but again, every candidate's experience is a little different. Um, and I've been around. Like, for example, like I can even talk about other companies, right? So yeah. uh, Amazon, for example, gave me like three rounds. Apple gave me eight rounds. Uh, Google in particular gave me seven in this case. But uh, there are other candidates which may have more or less, depending on what they're being hired for. Yeah. And what they're being paid for. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But like uh, still like seven round is like a big number. Like I'm just asking you that like there are a lot of people might be that someone who is listening to this podcast, he's on like round two or three and he's like, or like round five. And he's like, yeah, I've done like five rounds. Still, I haven't received any like uh, final offer or final verdict. Like what is wrong with me or like I'm not getting high. So just like there can be uh, like seven, eight, as you mentioned, uh, round. So just you yeah, have to... Yeah. Sorry about that. I think it's just important to take one round at a time and to break it down into small chunks. Don't worry about an interview once it's done. Once it's done, it's done. You can't change anything. Don't email or anything like that necessarily, unless, of course, it's a thank you email or something like that. But just forget about it. Focus on the next round. Focus on the next company. Um, you've done all you could. You've done your best. Whatever you did was perfect from your uh, standpoint. And now, if you made mistakes just improve on them but stay focused focus on the next round don't let one bad round ruin the next say if say if you have four more rounds after this don't let one round ruin the next four so yeah yeah you're right